Hi everyone, my name is Aria. I'm going to present Optimal Selfish Mining Strategy in Bitcoin. The paper is written by Ayolais, Jonathan, and Awis from School of Engineering and Computer Science, the Hebrew University of Jerusalem, Israel, and Microsoft Research, Israel. Bitcoin is a decentralized cryptocurrency and the protocol was created in 2008 and it is the more popular cryptocurrency since then. The Bitcoin network has generated total market capitalization around 1.5 billion US dollars in October 2013. Bitcoin nodes continually generate and propagate the blocks that each collect of a new approved transaction that are added to Bitcoin's ledger. The block is called blockchain. The security of Bitcoin is attributed by a chain of cryptographic puzzles that solved by a participant called miners. The more mining power a miner apply, the better are its chain to solve the problem first and the reward will be provided to the miner who can solve the puzzle first. In this slide, I'm going to talk about the problem in the Bitcoin system. Why the protocol requires nodes to quickly distribute newly created blocks, strong nodes can in fact gain higher payoff by withholding blocks that they created and selectively postponing their publication. The existence of such selfish mining attacks was first reported by Ethan and Siren, a two researchers from Cornell University, who had demonstrated a specific deviation from the standard protocol. From the standard of Bitcoin protocol, it states that a single miner's share of the payoff is equal to the fraction of the, compute, of the computation power that is controlled. So by using the surface mining strategy, the colluding miner could get more revenue than the contribution. The keywords that is used in the paper are in following, and I'm going to explain the detail of each keyword. First, selfish miner is a colluding miner who selective withholding the discover box and does not follow the Bitcoin protocol. Second, honest miner is a miner who follow Bitcoin protocol to immediately public a discover block. Third, selfish mining power alpha is a fraction of computational power in the network owned by a selfish miner. Fourth, attacker communication capability gamma, a fraction of nodes to which is managed to send block first in the case of block rate. What is mean block rate? When a block is discovered, it is transmitted to neighbor in a peer-to-peer -peer overlay network. If this block extends a miner's blockchain, the miner will begin mining on the analysis block and retransmit the block to its neighbor. A block race occurs when two blocks with the same parent block are announced at really the same time. According to the Bitcoin protocol, miners should always choose the block they receive first and not retransmit the second block. Since the block were announced at early the same time, some miners will see one block first, and other miners will see the other block first. This caused the blockchain to fall into two branches. Eyal and Cyrus' selfish mining scenario assumes that there are only two groups of miners, a honest community and a selfish miner. The honest community is not coordinated or consists of many actors. The honest community is assumed to represent over 50% of the Bitcoin mining power. 
why the self is smiling. It can be individual or in the group. This group is not follow the Bitcoin protocol and the computational power is considered as alpha and it should be less than 50% of the Bitcoin mining power. Selfish mining strategy is an intentionally forking the blockchains by selectively withholding blocks. It can create the consequence as the following. Limited competition in adding new blocks in the hidden private chain. It can waste the harness miner resources. And the harness miner could join with the attacker group and increase their possibility to gain control over the entire Bitcoin networks. In the surface mining strategy introduces by Yon and Cyrus, the share of the mining resource controlled by the surface miner is denoted by the alpha and the share of the resource owned by the harness miner is one minus alpha. These strategies rely on creating an information asymmetry between the surface miner private barn and the harness miner public branch. Formally, the strategy surface miner is played according to the following five rules. Even one, the harness community discovers the block. If the public branch of the blockchain is longer than the private brand of the selfish miner. Set the private brand equal to the public brand. Second, if the private brand is zero or one block longer than the public branch, probably the entire private brand. Third, if the private brand is more than one block longer than the public branch, probably the first and public block in the public chain. Even two, the colluding miner discovers a block. First, add a new block to the private brand. Five, if a block race is occur between the surface miner and the harness miner, probably the private brand to win the race. Contribution of this paper. First, we provide an efficient algorithm that compute an e optimal selfish mining policies for any e greater than zero and for any parameter of the model in the previous paper. One that maximize the revenue of the attacker up to an error of e, given that all the other nodes are following the standard Bitcoin protocol. We prove the correctness of our algorithm and analyze its error bound. We further verify the all strategy generated by the algorithm in a selfish mining simulator that we have decided to the end. Second, using our algorithm, we show that indeed there are selfish mining strategy that earn more money and more profitable for smaller miners compared to SM1. The gains are relatively small. This can be seen as a positive result, lower bounding the amount of resource need for a profitable attacker. Third, we show that in this model that account for the delay of block propagation in the network, the threshold vanished. There is always a successful selfish mining strategy that earns more than harness mining regardless of the size of the attacker. Model of optimal strategy. The surface mining decision algorithm is dependent of four characters. First, the state space. Second, action space with a DUI into four action. First, adopt. The attacker accept then of the harness network chains and discard the A block in the attacker's network, that A is the number of blocks that have been created by the attacker. Second, override. The publication of the attacker's block is public. This case is happen when the number of blocks created by the attacker is higher than the number of blocks created by the honest miner. Third, match. 
This is the case where the more recent block was viewed by the Hornets network, and the attacker was relayed at the same height of block. Third, wait. Attacker does not public new blocks, but keep working on its brand until the new block is built. And another two parameter is substitution metric and the reverse metric. We depict the result of our analysis, namely the revenue are shift by optimal policies compared to that of SM1 as well as the profit threshold of the protocol. In the following, alpha stands for the attacker relative computational power, and gamma is a parameter representing the communication capability of the attacker. On figure one, the profit threshold induced by optimal policies and by the SM1 as a function of gamma. Threshold at higher gamma value match that of the SM1. But still, the optimal strategy for this value earn more than the SM1 and once above the threshold. So far, our model assumes that no new block is created until all preceding published blocks arrive at all nodes. In reality, there are communication delays between nodes in the network, including between the attacker and the others. So, instead of modeling the attacker's communication capability via the parameter grammar, it may be better to directly consider the delay of the network. And then we can come up with the proof that when there are delays, even small minor profit from their variation. Related work. Bitcoin protocol has been introduced for the first time in 2008 by Satoshi Nakamoto. And then there are several papers that have been uh, published about Bitcoin protocols. In 2013, Eon and Siren has published the first paper that proven the unsecure of Bitcoin protocol. In the paper name, majority is not enough, Bitcoin mining is vulnerable. And then in next year, there is additional work of selfish mining we are brought with holding in the paper called Theoretical Bitcoin Attacks with less than half of the computational power by Leo Bahart. And then they are coming off a paper about how to stop the selfish mining strategy that has been created by Ethan Hemiland from Boston University. In conclusion, this paper is successfully to propose the deviation of selfish mining strategy that proven the lower threshold of colluding mining power to benefit over the honest mining. However, with the lacking of the reality simulation, this model is not 100% practical in the real world. Improvement suggestions. The model should be considered to use reality factor. For example, incentive of rational miner to join with the colluding pool. And further study should be continued in study of the qualitative deviation of optimal gain under delay conditions. And more accuracy uh, simulation in the reality network should be done, not just only in theoretical approach.